Hey everyone, in this video we'll be discussing how to add custom code to our funnels. So things like tracking softwares, uh, third-party integrations of some sort, plugins that you can add to your funnels to make sure that you add something custom to them. So how do you do that? Let's get inside the system and let's start adding our custom code. Now, let's say that we build this funnel and let's say that we want to add our Google Analytics for example, so that we can track our traffic. So, how you can do that? Just click on the funnel settings and then you have the custom code area. Basically in this, that, that area you can see that you have custom head, custom CSS, a custom body markup. So here you can add JavaScript, for example, from Google Analytics and that will execute for the whole funnel. You can also add some CSS. Basically this is style sheet, uh, you know, settings that you can add to modify the looks of your pages via some CSS. And you can also add some body markup as well. Same about CSS and JavaScript basically. You can also do it on a page level. So if you're in a specific page and you want to give you know some code only to put some code only for that page, such as some tracking pixel for example, only for that page, you can add them in the custom uh, you know page head markup, CSS and body markup that is for that individual page that you're currently on. So, for example, if you go to the checkout, for example, and there, if you go to the page code CSS or head, that code will only execute for this page. All right, this is it. This is how simple it is to add you know, global code, code for the whole uh, funnel and for individual pages. But for example, how do you add something that is like a custom, let's say, form or custom checkout or custom button or section of any sort? So when you click on the Add Widget option, here you can see the different widgets that you have. And you have the code widget. So let's say that you want to replace this uh, image of, an, of a woman, you want to replace it with, uh, let's say, some, some, uh, some kind of a custom code. You just drag and drop where you want a custom code to display. Now in this place you can add HTML, CSS uh, and, uh, and JavaScript that will execute on that specific place so let's say that you want to add a form or some kind of a you know whatever section that you want just paste in the code that is provided by you and that will execute on this section you can see it in action when you previewed your page and that's it this is how simple it is to add any code to your pages and any code to yeah inside the pages themselves and any code uh, into the code area of your pages Again, tracking, plugins, anything you can add with some CSS, some JavaScript and some HTML. Alright, if you have any questions, don't hesitate and let us know.